Okay, everybody, we're back. Core values number five. I'm gonna grab a sip of water before I get talking here. So hopefully you're doing the same because that is definitely part of what this whole thing is all about is your mindset, which is exactly what I'm talking about in core value number five. So you need to own the process. And when I say that, without having a positive mindset, weight loss is not going to be achieved and weight loss is not going to be sustainable. We are constantly being thrown curveballs in inside of our lives where time becomes of essence, stress is, is coming in the back door and we never know really how to sort of push that all aside and make sure that we are still focusing hardcore on the things that are most important to us, which should be your health. Okay, without a positive mindset and without you establishing what those real goals are, you're gonna have a very hard time staying on course because we are our own worst critics. I'm sure you've heard this before, but self-confidence is something that many of us struggle with, but we have to be willing to overcome that and we have to be willing to show gratitude. If gratitude is something that you are not practicing in your everyday life, I would highly encourage you to start this can dramatically transform your life, it can transform your weight loss, and it can transform your health. When you sit down for five minutes every single morning and take the time to write down, even if it's five things that you are grateful for, whether they happened yesterday, or perhaps you woke up with a sense of gratitude, I want you to write them down. When you start looking for gratitude inside of your life, you will be shocked at how much your mind starts to appreciate the things that you do have and the things that you do love about your body because at the end of the day, you are the reason you are where you are today, okay? How we change is how we grow. This is something we've talked about many times before, but we wanna ensure that you are owning the process. And when I say that, all of the decisions that you've made up until today have gotten the weight on. And it's up to you to own the process. Nobody can do it for you. No one can force you to work out. No one can force you to drink the water. Nobody can force you to meal prep or to eat healthy. That all has to come from your mindset. Our minds, our brains are one of the most important muscles to work in our entire body. You know, so legs aside, core aside, arms aside, if you are not in the right mindset, weight loss will never happen for you. And this might be the reason you failed many times before and you're blaming it on the diet or you're blaming it on the lack of working out. It all starts with your mindset. You have to wake up, you have to show up for yourself, show up for the best version of yourself. Because again, no one can do that for you. This is something we want to establish in our daily routine. So that gratitude is definitely a big piece of the puzzle. Starting your day off in a positive mindset as opposed to a negative one is a huge transformation in how your day is going to be laid out, okay? Another thing I wanna talk about is stress. This happens all the time and when our stress levels are through the roof, our cortisol, which is our stress hormone, goes up and then we store our fat. Okay, so imagine if you started to say no to everything in your life that was stressful. And when I say this, I'm talking about the people that put negative comments on your Instagram or your Facebook or something of that nature, or, you know, they're bringing you down. They're just negative people. So they'll give you a call because they're throwing a, you know, basically a pity party or they want someone to listen to everything negative that's going on in their life. It's time to say no more. If you are not positively feeding your mind with, you know, gratitude and the things that you're happy about around your life and things that you've accomplished, like, you know, establishing a system where you can go inside of your mind and think about all those things that you've accomplished in the past and will accomplish here in this program. Those are going to serve you way better than listening to somebody that is negative that's at the end of the day, it's causing you stress. So you need to cut these people out. As harsh as that sounds, it's the truth, it's the reality. They could be holding you back from seeing the results that you want to see. And that's extremely important to be aware of when, when we're talking about weight loss, okay? Because again, it's starting in the mind. When we talk about working out and ensuring that you're having that mind muscle connection, this is another thing when we talk about mindset. If you are thinking about the 10,000 other things that you have to do for the day and you're not focused on your workout and on your mind muscle connection, then you're going to have basically a 50% workout because your, your mind is not there. So push everything aside and as harsh as this may sound, the kids can wait. They can wait an extra 45 minutes for you to finish your workout and really get a good, 
you know, sense of working out that brain and working out that body and having those endorphins flying around and sweating out all those toxins because that's important for your mindset. When you have a really good workout, your energy is going to go up and then you're going to feel better about your day. So mindset training is all about having a routine and habit as well. You know, if you practice your gratitude, you're getting your workout in the morning, you're doing your internal cleanse, you're drinking your water. You know, this, this starts to transform your life because now you have a plan and now you have a positive plan. And when you start to see those results, the sky's the limit. Remember, keep a positive mindset, own the process from start to finish. You are in control of your own life. You are in control of your weight loss and everything else that happens inside of your lifestyle. So encouraging you to constantly be thinking about keeping a positive head, keeping a positive mindset through this journey over the next little while with Coach Kara. Bye.